How's it going guys? Carl here and today in Power BI I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the apply all slicer. All right this is the newest slicer they have in Power BI. Let's go ahead and dive into the dashboard so I can show you guys how the tool can be used. All right so we are in our Power BI report. As you can see the clear all slices is here. If you guys want to check out that video Go ahead and click up on the button, the card now, and it'll take you to that video. And if you want to use the apply all, so naturally in Power BI, what happens is if I start clicking, then Power BI starts to start doing stuff, right? And imagine if I started clicking apples or beef or beer, or if I come up here to click Northeast, or if I came down here to click 2022, I didn't want any of that to move until I'm finished applying my filters. So let's go ahead and clear this. So we're going to clear all these slicers, including that one. And what I want to do is I want to come here to add a apply all slicers. Now, once you add this apply all slicers, what happens is once you start clicking into a slicer. So if I just said, let's just say apples, appetizers, beef and beer, right? And then let's just add this one. And then if we say apply all, now we get to see what that looks like if we just use those particular filters. All right. So let's clear that. Let's let's do let's just do let's say if we come here now and say this, that, this, that, and apply all slicers. Now we see where all those products are sold. All right. And that is how you use to apply all slices in Power BI. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. We'll catch you guys in the next one.